Welcome to 7 Trumpets Prepper and in this video guys I want to share with you some very important information that you're not going to probably hear anywhere else um, regarding the blood moon lunar eclipses that are starting to take place this year. Now first off what I want you to do is for those that are interested in seeing this event and seeing what I believe to be the beginning possibly of the prophetic signs that are spoken of in Matthew, Joel, Revelation, and so on, and Isaiah 24. Uh, the list just continues to go on. Um, uh, Matthew 24 obviously being one of the greatest examples. But anyway, first off you want to go to, um, if this will bring this up right there, eclipse.gsfc.nasa.gov forward slash lunar.html. Now you look at this graph right here, now I'm not going to try to go all crazy scientific on you. What the main important thing to need to know is it's just like shooting a target. Alright, you've got the outer rings and you've got the inner is the bullseye. There's going to be a timetable when that the moon passes into the perfect bullseye of viewing. And then it's going to pass out. The key time you want to see this eclipse is going to be right here, okay? It's going to begin roughly about 7.07, and it's going to end at 8.25 a.m. Now, on the pagan Roman Gregorian sick evil calendar, it's going to be on the so-called date April 15th. For those who keep the Creator's calendar, who are celebrating Passover, it just so happens to fall the 14th on the Creator's calendar of the first month on the 14th day of April as well, uh, just so happened it lined up that way this year. But that night, when, as Passover is going on, and then the next day we'll begin Feast of Unleavened Bread on the 15th, before it begins an official day, all right, so it'd still be on the Creator's calendar on the 14th. That's very important for people to understand this. It is actually falling on the Creator's appointed times, as it's said. I've seen... Uh, some stuff I'll link, uh, Signs of Thy Comings, uh, YouTube thing where pe the media is already scoffing at this, okay? This is going to happen just like it, it's supposed to on the Creator's Counter. Now, if you go right here to worldtimebuddy.com and you put in where you live, this is very important. This will help you figure out where that it needs to be. Now, that is not my location, so don't come looking for me in the U.S., okay? That's a very arbitrary place. Uh, and But anyway... You come across here, and I put in the Greenwich Mean Time, um, Eastern Daylight Time, and another location in Tennessee, and it will be at 3 a.m. my time, okay? So it's definitely still in the dark hours, and that's important for people to understand um, it, it as far as visibility goes. Now, I know I have a lot of subscribers that follow me from all over the world, so now some of you might not be able to see this event um, there's going to be four of these take place, and before it's all said and done, over the next two years, you're going to have a chance to see one of these. This is very, very prophetic times coming ahead, folks. So anyway, I just want to share that with you because you're not going to find that info on in the news, and they're just blowing this stuff over and making fun of it. But anyway, I hope you get to enjoy this event, and until we see you again here at Seven Trumpets Prepper Channel, I hope you have a most blessed day in Yahushua's name.